In this video, I'm going to show you how to evaluate this uh, definite integral. When you say it is definite, it has upper and lower limits to it. In this case, it has a double integral. The, we are going to evaluate uh, a double integral uh, problem. x squared plus y squared inside the parenthesis dx dy with the upper limit of 3 lower limit of 1 the other integral is 2y lower limit is 0 at first step we are going to uh, deal with the x value we are going to integrate the x uh, never, never mind that y variable for a moment we're going to integrate x x raised to the second power if you integrate that that would be x raised to the third because uh, 2 plus 1 would be 3 and then copy the 3 and bring it to the denominator plus y squared bring down the y squared we're not going to deal with the y uh, for a moment and then bring the x here and the dx will disappear the letter d will disappear and then bring down the the dy and put the the upper and lower limits for the x substitute it to the x's put it there substitute that to the x's you're going to notice that uh, it is transformed to y the upper limit over here the 2y while the lower limits is uh, at the at this uh, right side of the problem that would be all zeros because uh, if you if you multiply or if you uh, uh, cube something that is uh, zero it will become zero all, all of them will become zero and then after that we're going to uh, raise that to the third power that would be x y raised to the third over 3 and then uh, y raised to the second will become y raised to the third because of this y 2y raised to the third over 1 minus 0 you can omit that 0 if you want to and this would be 8 plus 6 over 3 times 1 that's the way how to how to uh, to add uh, fractions that would be 14 y raised to the third over 3 segregate segregate the y raised to the third power if you segregate that that would be 14 over 3 and then y raised to the third power if you integrate that that would be y raised to the fourth over four like i said before you got to add one to uh, to the exponent and then copy the number four and place it to to the denominator then after that you're going to substitute the three and the one upper and lower limits again the same instructions Substitute the 3 over there. Substitute the 3 to the, y, to the y variable. And then there you have it. After substituting that, evaluate it. After evaluating, uh, 81 over 4 minus 1 fourth. That would be 80 over 4. Multiply the 14 over 3 to 80 over 4. And then if you you press it to the calculator then you will arrive with this answer and this will be your final answer i hope this makes sense and uh, thanks for watching